so today we're going to paint our Style 42's gold in the center and we're going to polish the lip up. So I've always liked this style wheel. It's uh, been on some of my favorite cars. The mesh style wheel with, with gold in the middle and um, a polished lip. So to do that on these Style 42's we have to start by removing these bolts. This is a two-piece wheel. Um, and those bolts are um, held together with these 12 point, let's see if we can get it to focus, 12 point fasteners. And so I had to buy um, the, they're, they're basically like Torx, but they're 12 point. Um, they're called uh, triple square. I'm going to go ahead and remove these, but you can't just remove them. You need to heat them up with a torch because there's there's a Loctite on it. So I'm going to go ahead and start that and remove all of these bolts and show you how that's done. When you heat up this one, I heard you just heat it up until until uh, it starts to get warm. Yeah, got it. That's gonna take a long time. No, it's not because the other ones are already hot. Alright guys, ready? Now that you can see the wheel taken apart, there are two phases to do this project. The first one is prep and paint the center of the wheel and then um, polish the outside lip. Okay, so now I have scuffed the wheel up with some Scotch-Brite and sandpaper. As you can see, I have scuffed up all the surfaces to the best of my ability. The next step is to uh, degrease it with some simple green and, and just give it a good wash with water and then do um, some paint prep which is basically another degreaser and then start spraying. Getting closer. Okay, so I just finished with the paint and the clear. I'm very, very, very happy with how this turned out. This is going to look spectacular. That's exactly the shade I was looking for. Man, that looks good. Okay. Time to put it together. All right, so I have the uh, the cleaned and now stripped wheel on the bench. So what I did was I stripped the clear coat off, like I mentioned, 
or like I, s I uh, showed in the, uh, the last scene there. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to go ahead and start finishing or make, uh, start polishing rather this lip. It's a little murky from water, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to use some high grit sandpaper up to a uh, thousand grit uh, just to clean up all the um, to clean and prep the surface really and then after that I'm going to use Mother's Mag Aluminum Polish to bring out a nice shine. Uh, I'm going to apply it with this wheel polisher from Meguiar's and um, and yeah, go from there. It should it should make this wheel or the lip shine. So we'll go ahead and, and cut to a time lapse and you can see me do this. Okay, so now I'm done with the polishing. I'm very happy with how it turned out. It's nice and shiny. It's a little hard to see from the lighting and, and everything in this position. I'm gonna go ahead and assemble the wheel, do a side-by-side -side comparison of the old versus the new. While you're watching me put the finishing touches on this wheel, be sure to click the subscribe button if you've liked this video. Uh, I do have lots of planned projects coming up for the E30 that I'm very excited about, and I hope you join me um, and follow along. Uh, but yeah, here is the uh, before picture and here is the after shot. I'm very pleased, and like someone said to me on uh, social media, it looks kind of like an Iron Man vehicle, which I thought was really cool. That's all for now. Until next time, we'll see you on the next project.